It was an interesting thing about Maureen O'Brien getting cast as yes. uh, Vicky. Apparently, they asked her at one point to dye her hair, which is such a such an ex boyfriend thing to do. You know, <laughs> like could you wear this scent? Could you dye your hair? And I, I am really impressed because she mm-hmm. basically was like, "Why don't you just recast the person who just left? Yeah. Like, why don't you just go get her? Yeah. Like, if you want yeah. someone, you want a Ford. brunette, get a brunette. But I'm not going to dye my hair, and I'm just like, good for her." Yeah, I mean, these days, you know, a showrunner might might still say, "We'd like you to dye your hair," but you wouldn't say, "I want you to look like an exact clone of the person who used to be on the show." <laughs> like, I think there's an understanding now that you, you contrast is good, yeah. uh, diversity is good, and you know, may, maybe the audience is ready for a blonde. <laughs> Goodness, the, the first blonde in Doctor Who.